Hey everyone, I'm gonna make a quick video about Ultra Magnus uh, pieces for a second. <clears throat> um, <laughs> everything's a mess right now, but uh, just gonna make a quick chat about Ultra Magnus uh, head variants. Um, I've got some of them set aside right here. So, um, average collector assumes there's one, maybe two uh, variants. One with a uh, a painted face and, and the antenna, and one with uh, no painted face and antenna. Uh, in reality, it's so much more complicated than that. Um, you've got a uh, helmet where it's got... Uh, painted face and antenna. The inside, you see that sort of oval thing back there. Uh, inside looks like that. And that one has a two. Now compare that to this one. Oval, painted, painted, like that there. No two. Here, you don't have the oval thing inside. It's only got one rib on the antenna instead of two like that one. And sides like that instead of the line through there. No two. Uh, trying to remember if I've got examples of one with uh, just like that, but with two on the back, I don't remember. Anyway, here is uh, what we call the tr uh, one of the transitional helmets. You can see it's got the dual right, right there, painted face, but you can see the antenna isn't painted. You see it's got a line right there, and that one doesn't have a two, but there's also a version that has a two. Here's one unpainted completely, oval thing inside, line there, no two. Uh, here's uh, that helmet but with a two on it. I just don't have it out of my bag. Here is uh, what I call a number six helmet, uh, or what Fred's side does. This um, doesn't have the oval thing right there, single rib, inside like that. No two. Maybe a version without a, uh, with a two, not sure. Uh, these are just the G ones, so I'm not pulling out my reissues right now. Um, there's also um, another helmet that I only have one example of um, that I hadn't seen posted generally. Oh, here it is. Um, it's a painted face, oop, painted face, dual ribbed right there. Um, see no two, but check out the underside. There's nothing there. No hole at all. No line, no hole. Uh, so that's weird. Um, hold on a second. Uh, continuing this video, uh, there's another version that has no brow ridges right here or here. It was painted both there. Um, I can't remember if I've asked Jason if it has a two or not. Did I? Oh, yeah, I did. And Jason confirmed it doesn't have a two on the back. Did he? Show the bottom. Yes, he did. Perfect. Uh, out there. Um, let's see. Um, and then um, I was talking to a guy on eBay. I just want to show uh, his. It's still one of the transitional examples. This is the one with uh, uh, the two on the back. Um, uh, let's see, you can go to Fred's website, and uh, it's over 20 years out of date at this point, but it's a, a good place to start um, learning about the different variants. Um, if you search on Facebook, you can find a page where I've talked about um, uh, many different variants, um, and not just... Uh, well, there's a lot of information I have here. Um, let's see. I made a big update post recently. 
Where is it? I don't know. Somewhere in here, I've got a big update. Um, it goes through a lot of updated information. Ah, here we go. Yeah, this uh, post right here has a lot of good updated uh, information. Um, basically updating what's on Fred's site with stuff I've learned since uh, Fred updated it. Um, some comments I have and some things I haven't even updated here yet. But anyway, um, that should be helpful for people that uh, want to start figuring out Ultra Magnus. That just focused on the um, the head. Something else I'll show real quick. I was pulling out some uh, <laughs> some uh, toys for my kid to play with um, this weekend and. Uh, my son and then I was looking and this is something I've been meaning to check for a while but I haven't um definitely just like with the uh, Optimus Prime cabs you can have different leg bracing here so this is what you'd expect to see on like an Ultra Magnus that um uh would be like a number six cab from Italy from the gig line um and this uh, this is a different problem I won't get into. Uh, like structure, uh, there may be more. What's interesting is both of these are rubber wheel. I need to do a deeper dive on uh, the cab variants because uh, there's not a whole lot of information out there and I'm trying to create it all. Anyway, I hope that um, interest uh, some people. And if you want to talk um, Ultra Magnus stuff, uh, let me know. I'm still in the process of doing a lot of cataloging.